secure the ratchet. Yep. Again. So with each ratchet, you get just a little bit more into the cut. Get more cut. Gotcha. And it's getting easier. Okay. Yeah, as you get into the pipe a little bit, it starts to yep. relax. So the uh, 16 and a quarter, is that pretty much standard for these commercials? Yeah, pretty much. Installation here with two inch commercial. We got one side on the left already threaded, and we're now adjusting the final side. And we're just going to start a little bit looser to make the other side meet. Oops, too loose. This being kind of down in the trench, it's a little bit more back-breaking labor than normal, but take your time and line them up and just make sure the threads start arranging and coming on clean to the other thread. I need a little more. We got the uh, unit in now, and we're just trying to go ahead and line it up, get the final tightening down. So we can adjust by pushing both ends of the pipe in since we're a little bit short, right? Much. Yeah, yeah just a hair short. Yep. So we're going to push in on both ends of the pipe, start screwing it in, and we should be uh, sealed up and in business. Help on the other side. Oh. Just need grips. I need a gripper. <laughs> but it is turning a little bit, eh? Yep, it's tight. Might have to turn the water on and check it now. But yeah, it's tight. about this installation as compared to others that you've done Clayton? This installation is a little bit more difficult considering the unit is placed at least a foot down in the ground so it makes leverage of a cutter a little bit less uh, accessible so as we get as we get uh, down deeper into the ground you just need a bigger space and uh, and we just came out here and dropped this in it took about 30 minutes to actually complete the installation. Uh, it would probably take a less time if we weren't filming it, <laughs> however. But, but, it's, um, but it is a uh, application that uh, people need to know about. Uh, uh, these type of uh, units are simple. And again, P 
PVC gives you a great deal of latitude as far as installation. That's why out in the country on farms you see a lot more PVC installations. So anyway, this is our, uh, our premier demonstration on this property. Uh, it's a perfect opportunity considering that, the, uh, that this section of ground has not had water since spring, since the rains. So it's been pretty limited in, in having irrigation. Uh, yeah, it's going to be fun to see what happens for absolutely, sure. Absolutely, absolutely. And maybe we'll plant some fruit trees now that we have, uh, uh, we have more um, irrigation out here. Gotcha. So uh, in terms of a lot of installations, say for the commercial 2-inch, what do, uh, what's some other scenarios that are common, more common than this for uh, people to uh, install? The 2-inch unit is, um, it has primarily been used on pools. Uh, and and that's the pool pump, a pump that uh, that uh, conditions the water for your pool. Uh, that's a two-inch water line, and uh, this would be the same unit. It's a two-inch commercial PVC uh, connection. Another place that it's used is in irrigation, and that's for farms. Currently, we have them on strawberry farms. We're putting them in for olive trees and and uh, for uh, pecan trees, onions, uh, virtually all types of plant uh, growing uh, places out in the out on the farm scenario. Uh, there are people installing four of these on four inch water lines. It's uh, for irrigation purposes and and what on irrigation what it does is it reduces the amount of water needed for plants to thrive to grow to their optimum potential we just finished installing a commercial two inch unit on pvc for landscape and watering system and uh, pvc is is one of the most um, forgiving uh, types of pipe. So it's easy to manipulate, it's easy to fix, it's easy to pull together. So we pull this unit together and the reason that we're here is this pipe had to be replaced. It was broken. So all of this out here, all of the trees and the grass out here has not been getting water. So we want this to be green. Because when you have a green zone, the climate is much more comfortable where we live. So we want this to be green and healthy, always. And therefore, we had to replace this pipe. And in so doing, it's a perfect opportunity to bring structured water into play. Because everything then will be much more lush, much more healthy, and, and therefore creating our green zone, this zone of comfortable living, comfortable space, and a very nice show place for our neighbors and for ourselves. Excellent. Clayton, thanks a lot for your time here today in this installation uh, live technique. It's been great, and uh, the folks at home hopefully will get a lot out of this. Thank you.